welcome to Retro Roulette, the show that asks the question, are you a pizza? I'm your host, Michael Riley. With me is Dane Forjone. You're a piece of shit. And Jason Amherst. You want a pizza, me? No. <laughs> no. No. Okay. What's the problem? Oh, no. Wait. Oh, no. What the hell is this? Oh. Uh, Side bike. Really? Um, maybe. Evidently not. Reset. Try it again. Uh, okay. So I guess... I'm guessing that's a no. Oopsie poopsie. You flipping kidding me on this? Dang. 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 Jello, 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 jello. Please work. Please, 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 please. please. Hey! Yay! That was a scary couple of minutes. Novice exhibition race. Guess we're going to start with Kyoto. Going to Japan. Because that's where Nintendo's from. We're going to go Jumpin' Jim Rivers, Tricky Ricky Stern, Sarah Sugar Hill, Bobby Big Dog Malone, Nigel the York, the Dork, the Duke. He's a, he's a dork, all right. <laughs> the Dork the Duke. Vicky the Vixen Steel. Okay, that's it. Let's just let's go with Jumpin' Jim Brunzel. Jumpin' Jim Brunzel. Jumpin' Jim Rivers. Okay. Um, Where's B. Brian Blair? He is a gay. He is gayer than the Michael Jackson. Mamma mia! Oh, Jesus. 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 This is the last proper Excite Bike game we've actually gotten. Because since then, they've done Excite Trucks and Excite Bots for some odd reason. Never heard of that. Whoa, whoa! Uh, they, they were on the Wii and Wii U. The steering in this game is fucking janky. Yeah, it is a little bit. Just gotta learn how to operate my brake. Oh, there we go. I think I got the hang of it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, piss. Oh, tits. Oh, fart. Oh, crap. <laughs> Into the final lap, Vicky Steele continues to lead the race. Lap three. Yeah, Excite Truck uh, was released on the Wii as a launch title. Jim Rivers, who's up to you? 
Oh, oh, oh. I might actually place here. Get out of my uh, the way. The sequel, Excitebox Trick Racing, was yeah. also released on the Oh, Wii. no. Come on. Damn it, purple people eater. Damn it, purple pooper, -po poopy, poppy, poo poo fart. Fifth place. Uh, this was followed up by a WiiWare game, Excitebike World Challenge. Oh, Or World <laughs> Rally. Damn it. Bobby Malone, the bone. Nigel the dork. Your at second place. Vicky Sex Appeal Steel. Ooh. Massive Sex Appeal. Dicky Lips Mulroney. Yeah, that's mine. You're Dicky Lips Mulroney? No, Ashley Miller is Dicky Lips Mulroney. Oh, I see. I thought you said that was your name, though. Anyway, I said that was my, I said that was my thing. Oh, okay. Uh, that now, was a line. That's my line. We'll we'll keep it with Jumpin' Jim. For a Jumpin guy named Jim. Jumpin', for a guy named Jumpin' Jim, he doesn't jump too good. Jeez, Did you see that they all ran you over? You should be dead. I know. Oh. I'm not a, I'm not a fan of these really fucking janky ass controls. I'd say this is a rather, like, accurate 3D representation of the original NES game. Oh, no, it, it's accurate. But you would hope the controls would be a little more fluid. Oh, God, Jim Rivers is dead. <laughs> he's dead. Yeah, she's dead. Better than I came back on the home special. <laughs> Come on, Jow! What? I landed on my bone. I landed on my car keys. I landed on my khakis. <laughs> Oh, is a nope. fucking idiot. Yeah, but he wrote some good Christmas parody music. Who? Jim Rivers. <laughs> Don't you mean Jim Neighbors? <laughs> I could have sworn it was Jim Rivers. I don't know. You wrote the, the, the Twisted Christmas tunes. Oh, okay. Yeah, like he's got that one that makes fun of the uh, the Chipmunk song. It's uh, Melvin. Melvin. Melvin! Oh, that, no, you're thinking of Bob Rivers. Oh, Bob Rivers. Ah. Uh. Yeah, man. You had half it right. You had it half right. Ooh. <laughs> I'm like you said, Jim. Ricky Stern is behind my rear. Yeah, Ricky Stern is behind your rear. Huh? How did he get there? He's attracted to farts. I see. He likes the smell of methane. Oh! Oh! Or, or is it euthane? I don't know. 
Fuck off, all of you. I want to win. Well, third place. Yay. That's not bad. Better than last time. Yeah. Getting better. Yeah. Nigel the Dork York is in was a, the the winner on that one, and then second place was Sarah. I've had thirty seven dicks this morning. Hill. Jesus. <laughs> in a row. What the fuck? In a row. <laughs> Damn, bro. Don't have to suck any dick on the way through the Excite Bike course. <laughs> There's Jay and Silent Bob giving the racers some Matt, meat. Matt, Matt, doodle doop, Matt, 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 doop doop, Matt, 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 doodle doop, Matt, Matt, meal. Would you like to have some fuck this in? <laughs> I am to be going. My love for you is like a truck there's air. Yeah. Yeah. Would you like to have some fuck this air? Yeah. So you do actually have to like tilt back and forward on the jumps to maintain speed. Yeah, to land properly. Just like original Excite Bike. I don't know so how would, accurate this they've is. They've kept that from the original game at least. I don't know how accurate this trivia is, but apparently that Berserker guy was just somebody they knew. Yeah. And they Most of the in people movie. in that movie are somebody Kevin Smith knew. <laughs> yeah. In yeah. fact, a lot of the... Oh, God, I was, like, fucking riding the rail there for a second. Um, and then the rail rided you. But yeah, a lot of the, and, and actually several of the characters were just were played by multiple pe multiple different people played multiple roles yeah. so there's only like six people in the whole movie <laughs> you got vulcanized tires yeah. I think the guy that fucks up their hockey game is also the same one that says in a row uh, when, when he finds out that uh, Dante's girlfriend sucked 37 dicks mm -hmm. and the guy who gets super offended he's also the same guy I think Oh god, I landed on the fucking barricade. Hi, Scott. Alright, I'm in third. Jim Rivers! Jim Rivers! Jim Rivers! Oh, Jim Rivers! One never, one never, hardly ever, hardly ever get sick at sea. You, uh, we had the same idea, I guess. <laughs> Great minds one think step. alike. What's our excuse? What's our excuse? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm on, uh, I'm on track to finish again in third place, which I guess is fine. Eh. And now get up the rail, you fucking goddamn son of a bitch! No! Get up, you lard bucket! Oh, That was good until I died. It was good until I died. That's, that's going to be Mike's obituary. It was good until I died. This isn't an excite bike at all. It's a depressed bike. No. <laughs> It's sad. This is sadness bike. <laughs> sadness bike. Oh, this is seasonal depression bike. Yeah. <laughs> this is I want to choke the life out of me until I orgasm bike. Jesus. Autoerotic asphyxiation bike. Asphyxiation bike. Oh. 
I'm ready. Let's race. No. Now I feel fuck bad. Yeah. Bobby Ding Dong Malone is what I thought it said. I know it's big. Oh, fucking tree. I just sunny bonoed. This this announcer sounds vaguely like the Wave Race guy. Could be. I mean, both Probably are the same person. It could be. Yeah, both are Nintendo properties. Nintendo IPs, I should say. Jim Rivers! <laughs> Jim Rivers! Fuck! Jim Rivers! That turned around somehow, and I don't know how. So, uh, at the time of this recording, senile old man with pumpkin makeup danced off beat in front of a crowd for 39 minutes. Halloween arrived early this year. Mmm. And that pumpkin is Albert Einstein. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's more likely Albert Brooks, but all right. Yeah. Uh, put, put on the music. Now, uh, could, could we get a little Ave Maria going? The Chris Cornell version? <laughs> oh, uh, uh, Ave Maria! Oh, uh, Oh, I, I feel like everybody got robbed. Can we play Ave Maria again, but this time the Pavarotti version? Oh, that version had no lyrics. Seriously, like, I, I, I am, I am really questioning anybody's sanity who supports the Orange Man at this point. Thoughts on Excite Bike 64, Dane? Um, well, as Jay said, it is an accurate representation of, well, 3D-wise, of the Excite Bike games. And as you started to get the hang of it, it was starting to get a lot better. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah. Jason? Yeah, I mean, it's Excite Bike, but in 3D, it's good. But in 3D? Yeah, uh, it's it's actually not so bad. Um, the controls do leave a little bit to be desired, but they're not too terrible for the most part. I can, I can for the most part, control where my bike was going. There was a couple times there where I got turned around somehow, and I don't know how, or I ran into a tree somehow. The tree actually clipped me on one of those ra on one of those uh, laps, strangely, even though I was nowhere near it. But anyway, uh, shit happens. Scores out of ten, Dane. Nine. Jason. Nine. Yeah, I'll give it a nine. All right, we're going to play, uh, or spin the wheel, rather, and then we'll play another game, whatever it lands on. It lands on Mike's choice. Okay, this is my choice. Oh, boy. Well, you know me and puzzle games. And this is just Tetris Attack, so... Hi, Professor Oak. Hello, Ash. I have an important message for you. This was handled by, uh... Nintendo of Europe, I believe. I'll go sign up. Pick up me. I'm so proud of you, Ash. You can tell from they all used, the, uh... They, you can tell from all the uncut penises. You must hurry. Well, <laughs> 
Uh, they, they, uh, they used actually a lot of audio from uh, poor kids, though, uh, from the uh, uh, dub actors to the uh, uh, actual like music produced for the anime. Really hope this doesn't get us like flagged, but. No, because this is on uh, Nintendo Switch Online. Okay. I mean, that like this is that, actually the song that mean "To Be a Master." I was gonna say that doesn't mean anything. They could have just secured the rights for it for the Nintendo Switch game. Yeah. I want to be the very best, like no one ever was. Ba, 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 ba. Well, well, well. It looks like if you made it after all, only true Pokemon. Trainers are allowed to compete in the Pokemon Puzzle League. Let's see what you are made of. Oh, it's skin and bones and muscle and flesh. Um, I'll be Pikachu. Let me take. Wow, Gary, you're stupid. Wow, well, stupid. Putting a water type up against an electric type. Yeah, nobody ever said the man was smart. This is the son of a, po well, grandson of a Pokemon professor. He's the grandson of a fucking moron. Wait, what? He's. He's a son of a bitch. Stop being so mean. How do I get it to. Oh, there we go. There we go. Like, how do I get it to, to give me give me some more blocks? <laughs> I'm trying to win. <laughs> I wanna I wanna play the game. <laughs> I could not. I'm trying to play the game. No, Dabba. You son of a bitch. So this isn't Is this kinda like Robotics mean bee machine or no, something that's, a it's more uh, like this is, Tetris this is, Attack. Uh panel depon, aka yeah. Tetris Attack. Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. Gotcha man. What? But this straight up used music that was off the Pokemon to be a master soundtrack. I wanna eat see your titty breasts. Can you please pull them out? Like the title track, To Be A Master. Like, I, I had that CD when I was a kid. Like, To Be A Master, Pokemon Master, I will be striving, will be striving. Like, it's such a freaking cheesy ass CD, but. Yeah, get fucked, Gary. You fucking... The guy that wrote uh, music for it, I think, later went on to uh, be like a music producer for like Lady Gaga. Nice. Roma, ooh la la. The Lady Gags is fun. Uh, let's see here. Da -da -da -da. Of course, these are the uh, original four kids' voices for uh, Pokemon. So this is like Veronica Taylor as uh, Ash. Nice. What the? Where are all these big blocks coming from? He's doing combos and shit. It's fine. I'll I'll beat him eventually. Way to go. I'm gonna win. Yay! I mean, Gary's about to die, so. Gary's really about to die. There's going to be some combos happening here in a second. Yeah, we yeah. all live in a Pokemon world. Pokemon. Yeah, this is like uh, later on one of the other season openings. Get fucked, Gary. Greatest master of the mall. Gary is a stupid whore. 
<laughs> I want to say that was, uh... Next time, I won't go easy on you by picking a fucking worse Pokemon than you. Brock. Hey, Asha, I'm going to oh. fight you in Pokemon even though we're friends. So, I'm the leader of the pewter gym. The winner gets to fuck Misty. <laughs> Pretty sure Misty doesn't want to fuck you, but my father's um, a deadbeat. Let's go with Squirtle this time. Okay. I was expecting him to pick Vulpix because I figured he was an idiot, but nope. I'm gonna be the greatest Pokemon breeder because I'm a horny bastard. Yeah, it's true. He pretty much Isn't was, he also... wasn't he? Yeah, he like also... that, that was that was actually his goal in the anime. What's the fuck? Once Misty? he left the pewter gym, was to become a Pokemon breeder. Yeah, he wanted to fuck Pokemon. Wait, what? Doesn't didn't he also want to fuck Nurse Jenny or whatever her name was? I mean, it was it was uh, Officer Jenny and Nurse Joy. Who didn't want to fuck Nurse Jenny? I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, which is funny because like. There's actually a song that they wrote for him. Jenny, oh Jenny, joy, oh joy. One woman means what I want to be, but there's two perfect girls for me. Okay. I want to be a yeah. polygamist like no <laughs> one ever was. <laughs> <laughs> I want to fuck this snow so, Wow. So the song in the background right now. You're in the BBWs. On. Sorry, BBPs. Big, the beautiful song, Pokemon. The song in the background is from that To Be a Master CD. It's The Road to Viridian City. It's like, we're on the road to Viridian City. Oh, Lord. There we Lord. go. Just wanted to get that out of the It's, that it's blocks. funny, you know, we're making jokes about fucking Pokemon, but that was part of the whole controversy over the Pokemon uh, leak that came out was some of the documents uh, were beta documents about the lore of the games. And as we know, Pokemon built its world around real world locations so they tried to build lore around real world lore and mythology and real world mythology built itself around no. humans fucking animals so of course there's going to be pokemon lore that's questionable like that too yeah. are you telling me Exactly Somebody that. in the Pokemon company wrote "quote unquote" fan fiction about humans fucking Pokemon. Yes, and it leaked. No yes, I um probably did it down the whole life without hearing that. Hmm. It's it's my fault for asking. Yeah. No <laughs> nobody, nobody was gonna argue that. Me boom boom bong bing bang bong. God, why why are the Japanese so weird? I mean, when I you've mean, been again, when you've been isolated no on because, like, yeah, get fucked. Th Brock. Think about it for a second. Like real life history, there are countless ancient religions that have mythology stories. Where humans fucked animals. The Romans. How many times did Zeus turn into an animal and fuck a woman? A lot. Exactly. I mean, Zeus pretty much fucked all the women. <laughs> like every exactly. woman that ever existed, including his own daughters. For some bizarre reason, he turned into an animal to do it for no reason whatsoever. Yeah, he could have just... He was he could have just used his human wang. Ash, yeah. I am happy to see you. Oh, now, now I'm sad because I'm reminded that the actress who played Misty died recently of cancer. Might as well use Bulbasaur. Why not? Plant versus water. Interesting. 
Fun fact, Staryu is an Ultraman reference. I actually knew that. <laughs> yep. Everything one, one about Staryu and Starmie. Yeah. From, from the blinking light uh, when it's low on health to the noises that it makes. But then again, that's also like a good 90% of early Pokemon shit is Ultraman references. Most of them are giant Kaiju. Pokemon going into tiny little balls. Yeah, that was pulled from Ultraman. Tiny like... little balls. <laughs> tiny balls. See Don Ho sing about tiny balls. I would rather not do that. Well, why not? Because I, I just don't? Is, 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 is that okay? Oh, I guess. I mean, considering the fact that Don Ho has been dead since 2007, he was singing tiny balls right now. He, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Why, you bring, why you gotta bring logic into this? Because because I said stuff. Tiny balls. Tiny balls. I'm just picturing like an angry zombie, Dono. Tiny brains. What the fuck? Why is Misty you fighting know, I, you? Uh, because you're going through the entire, like, all the gyms getting the badges. Yeah. Getting the badges. So, we don't need So eventually you will badges. have to, uh, you know, go through the Elite Four. And also Team Rocket. Ha. Give me all them blocks. I mean, this, this is this is fun and all, although it doesn't beat Kirby's Avalanche and how big of a dick Kirby is to everybody in that game. Good like that is a fun puzzle spinoff, just because Kirby's such an asshole. Like, wow, Kirby, no chill whatsoever. <laughs> Damn. Come on, Kirby, why are you being a dick? Good battle! Poyo! <laughs> you know what? Fucking Poyo, okay? How about that? Yeah! Yeah! We won! The lose bar makes it look like Pit Misty's not wearing any pants. Yeah. I almost called her Pisty. <laughs> <laughs> Which would have been appropriate, I think, in that case. And, uh, wow. I can't believe I'm about to say this again. We're about to come across another character who, whose voice has passed away. Ready when you are. Lieutenant Serge? Yep. The voice of Lieutenant Serge was also the original voice of Meowth, who was also a trans actress. Yeah. Yep. Hmm. Maddie oh. Blomstein. Surprised you haven't told me what music this is from. I don't recognize this one offhand. Ah. That's some of these fair. I think were uh, some of these I think were generic uh, like background music from the show. Ah, okay. Guess that's fair. 
Um, but Did some of them were them? like very noticeable, uh, like actual songs that had lyrics. It honestly sounds like Ash keeps saying "Waco." Like, Ruth? like what is he a fan of Ruby Ridge? <laughs> <laughs> no, he just really hated Joe Lieberman. Ow! <clears throat> well, who did? That's fair. He wanted to get rid of video games because he was a stupid head. He thought they were violent. What is so violent about this fucking game right here? Uh, yeah. you're throwing, you're throwing blocks you know at who me. else just came out? Uh, you know who just came out against video games? Uh, who? Dr. Disrespect, hopefully. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, Donald Trump. <laughs> oh, well, of course. That's because Donald he, he Trump is a crackhead. He just came out in a freaking statement saying that violent video games are the cause of everything and we need to ban video games. Oh, fuck, I, that, that's fuck you, Trump. Very, Trump. <laughs> yeah. Listen, I don't... I, I, I definitely... I, I've always said this show is nonpartisan. We make fun of both candidates equally. But I'd, I could think it's safe to say, considering the nature of this show in particular, fuck you, Trump. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> I I couldn't beat the first stage of Super Mario Brothers. I'm going to take it out on everybody else. Wait, what the hell is a Pikachu? That's what you've been doing to Ivanka for years. <laughs> Dondi, Dondi, why don't you take a peek at me, Dondi? Is that your Ivanka impression? No. No, that's that's Eric. Congratulations. <laughs> don't you want to see my paginas? <laughs> no, no, Erwin, I don't. I am quite fond of plant. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Woo. Woo. That thing looks like that thing looks like a stoner Pokemon. I mean, uh, it's, it's based off of the real life uh, Rafflesia. I don't know what six of those words meant. It's it's a real play. Uh, it's the character that Martin played on his television show. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh my god! Here is hey, you mean the Shenanigans play? Is is really, I, I I recognize this song. This is, what kind of Pokemon are you? How do you do the things you do? What kind of Pokemon are you? Is that really what it's asking? Yep. What kind of Pokemon are you, yep. Jason? I'm gonna win. What kind I'm of Pokemon? Type. I'm Barbara fucking Walters. What kind of Pokemon are you? Excuse me. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a dark type. All right. What about you, Jay, uh, Which... Dane? What, what type of Pokemon are you? Uh, I'm, I'm an Aries. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, every, everybody knows that I am secretly an Incineroar. I think I would be, I feel like I would be the Incineroar. I'm the wrestling type here. <laughs> what's the one, uh, what's the one with the four arms that's really jacked? That's the one, Jason. <laughs> Is that Machamp? Yeah, I'm a champ. Yeah, why not? <laughs> you don't want to be a Machamp? You, well, you're the champ of my heart. Oh. oh. God damn! I kicked his. I kicked her ass in like a minute and a half. <laughs> Jesus. Just, uh, even Jesus couldn't help her. Absolutely not. Thoughts on Pokemon Puzzle League, Dane? That was a lot of fun. I was enjoying that. I like puzzly puzzle games like that. And look at that—you won the—you won the rainbow badge. I did. I am a member of the I'm Rainbow right. Brigade now. Uh, Jay, I'm Jay. very proud of you, son. <laughs> You're welcome, Jason. I wouldn't mind seeing you go through a whole playthrough of this one day. No, because this is this is a fun uh, puzzle game. Yeah, I agree. Uh, I, I've i always enjoyed... Okay, so Tetris Attack is just a fantastic game in general. But um, even even still, like, it's Panel to Pawn has always been a fantastic puzzle game. It's been one of my favorites. 
Uh, I always, I've always loved playing Tetris Attack. And Pokemon Puzzle League is a great adaptation of Tetris Attack. Um, you take the, you take the original panel to pawn, you put a coat of Pokemon over it, and it's, mwah, perfection. Scores out of 10, Dane. Nine. Jason. Nine. I'm actually a little bit more partial to it. I'm going to give it a 10. It was a good pick. I'm glad it's it was a pick. Mike's choice pick. We're going to spin this wheel one more time and see what we're playing for the final episode. Final game of the episode. Yeah, that was uh that was a rare game oh. not made by uh No, that was that was not it was not made by Rare. I don't know what you're talking about. No, it was made by Nintendo <laughs> Software Technology, which is uh actually uh uh Yeah. Hey uh hey Dane. Hmm? Yeah. Yeah, pick a game. Um Landed on Dane's let's choice. See. What do we have left? Um Mario Tennis. That's a good that would have been that was my other choice for Mike's pick if puzzle league hadn't have been had been selected already so it is a good choice this means we're going to finish today with two diarrhea cards so the next time we do roulette it'll be three we'll start with three we gotta find we gotta play mario strikers where while we uh, my bad we, we end with one diarrhea card i forgot we, we did diarrhea card three games the first episode of this the first episode of the session so we will start next session with two here's the game that waluigi was invented for final all right, let's get to it. Mario Tangy. <laughs> View the options. Uh. All right. Oh, who should I be? I be Boo. Boo 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 boo. I be boo. Bobby boo, Bobby. Bobby. You be Bobby boo. Bobby Boucher. Let's put boo against. Uh, why not? That way, Waluigi gets some love. We got the hard court, we got the clay court, we got the grass court, we got the composition court, we got the Super Mario court, we got the Peach court, the Wario, the Yoshi, the Waluigi, the Bowser, the Mario. The Waluigi court, baby. Oh, no, the Mario Waluigi court. The Wario, yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, baby. Eh. <laughs> I'm stepping on my own face. Swear. <laughs> oh shit, I let it go out of bounds. Did you see that glint in Waluigi's eyes? That was kind of strange. Oh shit. Haha, -ha, bitch! Ah, damn it. See, there's your problem. You have to hit the ball. Shut up. I'm just saying. Yeah, hit that. <laughs> well, I can't because I'm not physically playing the game, of course. I know you want to hit that. I know you want to hit that. Hit that. All oh, the brothers that get it, my friend. Hey. Some been Dugan, hey. Flargan, Wigan Bay. I forgot, uh, I forgot the words. Yes, you did. 
<laughs> yeah, eat a deuce. Ugh, never mind. Don't do that. <laughs> yeah, that didn't that didn't quite come out the way you wanted it to. Did yeah, the deuces never do. <laughs> no. Actually, they're kind of stinky. That's advantage me. A game point for me. Of course, he could tie it right back up here. Oh! Ah, it was right Whoa. over his head! Yeah! I am the game boom! Nope. Nice job! I am the game boo! Now yeah, it'll be wait Waluigi a minute. serving. Hold on a sec. If I were the umpire in this game, Shit. who would play the umpire if I was playing? Also, Mario. But that doesn't make sense. It's not a minta too. Oh, get absolutely <laughs> fucked. They stick their hand in the air. And us. And us. And us. And us. Thank you, Cookie Monster. It's Waluigi's favorite place to stick the penis. I was going to say, that was uh, more like uh, classic arcade Donkey Kong. Da, da, da. Ah, you bitch. <sighs> All right. Getting kind of sloppy there, boo. Why are you talking to your girlfriend like that? <laughs> oh. 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 Why you gotta be like that? Eh. Oh. Ah, no. <laughs> ah shit. It's funny, Boo's laugh sound effect is actually from a sound effect CD, and it's sped up. And the sound yeah. effect of that laugh was recorded by Charles Martinet. Damn it. Really? Yep. It's actually the same laugh sound effect that's also used for Bowser, just slowed down. Hmm. So technically, both Bowser's laugh and Boo's laugh are Mario. Charles Martinet just played everybody, didn't he? More or less, yeah. Oh, shit. Did I hit him in the face? I did, I hit him in the face. You a motherfucker. You're not supposed to return the ball with your nose. You have a racket? You wild a fucker. <laughs> you wild a fucker. <laughs> oh, shit on my dick. I let him ace on me because I was a fuckhead. Come on, fuckface. Yeah! Is this, the first, is this the first game that Waluigi appeared in? Yes. Yep. He was made for this game so that Wario could have a doubles partner. Oh. Ah, shit, no! They Piss! Almost, oh. They almost made a Wapeach as well. Oh, can you Ooh. imagine? Inside out vagina? Uh. <laughs> Actually, the uh, the illustration did come out, and it wasn't that bad. Actually, your nipples would have been inverted, Mike. I don't know what you're talking about. Stop it. <laughs> I really don't need to hear about put, Wapi. They would, have, they would have put her boobies on upside down. It was really weird. <laughs> they curved up Next, you want to talk? Like, be, like, talk? like black orchids tits and killer instinct. <laughs> oh. 
Can we talk like, about something less gross like Wad Daisy? Two scoops of raisin bran. <laughs> oh, Wad Daisy was even worse. Like her tits were wrapped around her neck like a scarf. Uh, <laughs> God damn it. I don't even he get aced me, on me again. Don't even get me started on Wadaki. <laughs> oh Jesus. He has no hair. Wang Gi Kong. Wah. Uh, I'm uh, I'm sharing it in the chat uh, here on uh, Discord, so uh, you so you can pull up the picture later in the edit. So, uh, but uh, this is the actual part that was shared by the artist that worked on the game. This was uh, going to be Wah Peach. I was expecting something more gross, actually, honestly. I was inspired by an actual manga character. I feel like she probably would have become a sex symbol much as Waluigi somehow has. Yeah. Because, well, I mean, Luigi with his dancing and the roses and everything, oh, you know. God damn it. Waluigi's a sexy bastard. You know, I was... And he knows it. I was expecting a picture of Wapi to be so grotesque oh, damn it. that even... I wasn't paying attention. Even, Jun that he, even Junji Ida would have been like, oh, that is disgusting, even for me. Yeah! To make a comeback. <laughs> Wamma mia. Wamma mia. Wamma mia. Ha! Eat a shit. It's like eat a shit. Wamma mia. Eat a shit. <laughs> Buongiorno, fat piece of shit. Deuce! <laughs> I love the way that Mario says, Deuce! <laughs> I have to drop a deuce! Hey, can we finish this game up? I have to take a big deuce! <laughs> it really sounds like he's saying gay point. Yeah. Damn it! He got me. Stand up, bitch. Ha ha! Ah! Boy, well, Waluigi, you're slacking. Did you did you hit him in the ball? Oh, the replay didn't show where it hit him. I don't know. I think it was the face again. I can't help it. He's got a big nose. Oh, no. dicks. Get point. Oh, shit. I forgot I could control where the ball goes. Fuck. Not controlling it too good. Eh. Yeah! Eat a shit! Don't you mean eat a deuce? Yeah, that's... yes. Eat a deuce! <laughs> Kind of uh, side tangent. Apparently, uh, the idea was that Wario and Waluigi were meant to be uh, sort of uh, subservient to Wa Peach in a way, uh, 
they they were inspired by the uh, lackeys to the villain from this uh, anime and manga called Yatterman, apparently. Okay. And one look at the guy Doronjo, and you can kind of see Waluigi a little bit. Yeah. He's got the nose and the mustache. The set is yeah, mine. I genuinely don't want to stop playing this, but we have to. Thoughts on Mario Tennis, Dane? It was a lot of fun. It's always nice to play Mario-inspired sports games. I like, you know, like Strikers and golf, but tennis is definitely yes. no snap. Unfortunately, Strikers is GameCube, so we're not going to get it in this roulette. But, yes, I agree. Jason? Mario sports games are the best sports games yep. so, uh, alongside the midway sports games so yeah, like, your blitzes and your jams and your yeah what have you NHL so, hits. i mean like you're 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 gonna have your most fun with those games so and i mean like by far it's just freaking so much fun so much fun yeah i agree uh this is a fantastic tennis game and honestly recommend playing this to anybody especially if you have two or three people to play with that would be the best option uh scores out of 10 dane Dang. jason 10 also a 10 on this edition of the show we played excite bike 64 pokemon puzzle league and mario tennis best game of the episode dane oh this is a tough one They're three good games um, I'll give it to Pokemon. Jason? Oof, triple banger. Uh, I'm going to give it to Mario Tennis. Uh, I, I hate breaking ties, but, you know, my heart's with Pokemon Puzzle League, so I'm going with that one. Thanks for joining us on this edition of Backseat Gamer, a retro roulette. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe. Be sure to the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Dane Fortune and Jason Amherst, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time.